Hey everybody, this is Fabian Anlicker and welcome to this video. In today's video, I quickly want to show you how you can back up your lists that you have in GetResponse. Uh, this is actually anyway a very important topic, backup itself, if, it, if it's for blog or it's for lists or for your whole uh, homepage that you have. That's something that you need to do on a regular basis because you never know if, uh, I mean this sounds maybe a little bit stupid, but you never know if a company goes broke, if they shut down the service or whatever, and they, they would just leave you alone with what you have right now. They would not give you the data or whatever. So this is something really important that you need to do, as I said, and in the example right now we just go over to get response and I went to contact search contacts and you can do an advanced search and you just choose any list or any campaign that you have in this case I took I took just a small one that I had um, and did some tests as you can see I have 24 active subscribers here I scroll through the list you can see them here and now the only thing that you actually have to do is you click here on actions you click on export now you can give a name for this list so let's just say this is a test backup then you can choose the format if it's a CSV XML or XLS file I just choose the CSV for this example, then click on export. That takes some time and now you can see here your test backup.csv. The only thing you have to do right now is you down you click on this download link and as you can see now it saves the file on your local computer and that's actually about it. So what I would do or suggest is that you do this with every campaign or every list that you have on a regular basis especially if your list grows fast then I would do it maybe not on a daily basis but uh, at least weekly or every second every third day it depends on how fast your list is growing and of course also it's about the risk that you want to take but um, I would just do it on a regular basis so you never know uh, it's not only that, uh, for example, get response could go broke. I mean, I would not expect that. But what you never know, and you hear that from lots of uh, marketers, that an account gets shut down immediately for whatever reasons, and then you have no chance to get your account back. And at least what you want to have is a backup of all your lists, so you can either open a new account with GetResponse and import them or you go to a completely other company and you can import the list there. But what you need at least is a backup of your lists that you can use somewhere else. So this was the example of uh, GetResponse. Uh, of course you can use it, you, you can back up the lists with every company, email companies I would say. So. Um, if you are with Aweber, they definitely have something similar that you can use. This was the example with uh, GetResponse. Do that on a regular basis, so you can avoid any stress in case they shut down your account or whatever could happen. So you keep your lists and that's, that's actually it for the video of today. And see you in the next one. Thanks for watching and goodbye.